In a trial that has captivated animal rights activists and First Amendment advocates, Wayne Hashiung, attorney and co-founder of Direct Action Everywhere, DXE, found himself at the center of a legal battle. The jury's verdict, announced on November 2nd, 2023, left Wayne in a difficult position. He was found guilty of three of four charges in the Sonoma rescue trial. Immediately following the verdict, Xiong was taken into custody, where he'll stay until his sentencing on November 30th. Wayne Xiong, a former constitutional law professor, faced misdemeanor trespass and felony conspiracy to commit trespass charges for open rescues of chickens and ducks. The trial's outcome sparked outrage among animal rights activists. Donnie Moss, founder of TheirTurn.net, questioned the justice system, where animal rescuers are labeled criminals. Xiong represented himself, as he has in previous open rescue trials. These trials are seen as crucial milestones to secure the legal right to rescue suffering animals. In some previous cases, he was found not guilty and successful in defending others in animal rescue cases. In December 2021, Wayne was found guilty of felonies for rescuing an infant goat. Representing himself, he received a suspended sentence and probation. Unchained TV tried closely followed the Sonoma County case but faced restrictions, as cameras were banned from the courtroom. If you want to know more about this, I recommend checking them out. The prosecution honed in on Wayne Xiong as the lead organizer in open rescues of chickens and ducks. Charges were dropped or plea deals accepted by other co-defendants. Activists claim that prosecutors aimed to cut the head off the snake of the open rescue movement, resulting in extreme measures and a gag order on Xiong. Animal rights activists maintain they acted within the law to rescue suffering animals due to alleged violations of animal welfare standards. This is why we need animals to have rights. Animal welfare is meaningless for the law. Without animal rights that create a mandatory compliance to uphold the welfare standard, change will be slow. Because of rumors of vegans actually being denied their jury duties just because they were vegan, Wayne had to resort to a questioning method known as voir dire to find out how biased his jury really was. During the trial, unusual decisions by Judge Laura Pasaglia raised concerns among supporters of animal rights and free speech. She prohibited the defense from showing the jury photo and video evidence of animal cruelty, denied Xiong's use of a necessity defense, which argues that the defendant had no choice but to break the law to prevent a greater harm, permitted Xiong to make a mistake of law defense which argues that the defendant had a good faith belief that their actions were legal, prohibited Xiong from speaking with the media about the case, excluded key defense witnesses, video, photographs, and other evidence that the defense had hoped to use to explain why activists did what they did. She denied the defense's request to show the jury evidence of animal cruelty and only allowed Xiong and some other witnesses to describe the conditions they filmed or reviewed that help it form their belief that they could aid the animals inside Sunrise and Reichardt. She excluded Dr. Laura Dixon, an animal scientist specializing in the poultry industry, and Dr. Armaiti Mai, a veterinarian who made an assessment regarding animal cruelty at Reichardt Duck Farm in 2014. She granted a defense request for Sunrise Farms and Reichardt Duck Farm documents of the conditions at their facilities, but agreed with the prosecution to a protective order, preventing the documents from being shared with the public. Wayne Xiong's case raises questions about the fairness of the Sonoma rescue trial and the fight for animal rights. Despite facing legal challenges and multiple convictions, Wayne Hsiung remains a passionate advocate for animal rights and environmentalism. Wayne Hsiung, a relentless warrior for a more compassionate world, a true modern age superhero. Please help us fight this injustice to hide injustice. Go vegan and don't give injustice a chance to begin with.